They've been ignoring you, but will soon be begging you. They will be begging you to work with them. They will be begging you to collaborate with them. The very people who acted like you did not exist. The same people who did not want to work with you. They will be wishing that they had not left you unseen when you contacted them on social media. They will be wishing that they hadn't ignored you. You will have become so huge. You will have become so successful. The very people who turned their backs on you, who had zero regard for you, they will be begging you. They will want a piece of you. There you were, asking them to work with you. There you are, wishing that they would help you in some way. They won't. You're not big enough. Perhaps you're just starting out. You're working on something. It's not successful as yet. They're thinking that this is how it's gonna be for you. You started something. You started a YouTube channel. You have very few subscribers. You're working on a product. The product is still very small in terms of sales or in terms of the attention it's receiving. Everything is small. You're working on something. You're learning a new skill. You're not so good as yet. You're a nobody according to them. They do not realize how great you gonna be how much of a winner you are gonna be they are treating you with so much contempt so much disdain you're small you only have a few Instagram followers hmm you're not so good as yet it's not gonna stay like that forever your current situation that is not how it's gonna be tomorrow your past your present this is not how it's gonna be in your future you building that foundation it's like a builder it's like someone building a house today they're in the mud they're digging the foundation all dirty at first glance it doesn't look like something huge is happening they're still in the dirt people are looking at them disrespecting them looking at them with so much contempt not realizing that very soon there will be a massive multi-million dollar structure, multi-million dollar building on this land. Not realizing that there will be swimming pools, not realizing that this property will be worth so many millions tomorrow. They see you today as a cub, not recognizing the fact that tomorrow you're about to roar like a powerful and strong lion they're laughing they're making fun hmm they don't want to work with you they will work with bigger people quote unquote 
I'm here to tell you don't worry, don't bother, don't think that because you are small today, quote unquote small, according to their eyes, that this is how it's gonna remain. Have you decided to be an advancer? Have you made that decision to be an advancing man or an advancing woman? Have you made that decision? If you've made that decision, if you know that that is how you're gonna be, if you know that this is who you are, no one can stop you. No one can be prevent you from growing. No one can stop you from becoming more. Let them treat you with disdain today. Let them regard you with disdain today. Day. The same people who are rejecting you today, tomorrow they will be saying, Oh, but this person messaged me. Oh, but they contacted me sometime. Today you're big. Today you're thriving. Today you're on TV. Huh? Whether it be on TV, figuratively or in reality, today, things are working out for you. Things have always been working out for you. But now it is clear for the average person to see. You always knew it. You are the first person who must believe in yourself. I said you are the first person. People will recognize it later. So until they recognize it, they will want nothing to do with you. They will not want to collaborate with you. You're messaging them, they don't want to see you. They're not responding. But the day will come. The day will come where, when, the day will come when they will be the one in your inbox. They will be the one in your DMs. They will be the one trying to get your email address to send you a message. You will have become so grand, so big. Don't worry. When people reject you, don't worry. You know why? The stone that the builder rejected will be the cornerstone. The stone, the stone that the builder refused is about to be the head of the corner. Hmm? You who were rejected back then, You're like Nelson Mandela. He was put in jail, right? 20 something years, over 20 years in prison, Nelson Mandela. Hmm? Some people doubted that he would have ever been on top. But you know what happened when he left prison? He became the president. He became the president. Let them look at your situation today and think that this is it for you. Hmm? And I'm not saying that you're in a bad situation, but you know there is always room for growth. There is always room for improvement. There is always room for becoming more. You'd never get it done. You're always growing. You're always advancing. Hmm? As the breeze is blowing. So let them look at you that way today. Let them laugh at you. The last laugh will be yours. You will have that last laugh. Let them know that it is not about the first, second or third laugh. Or even fourth. <laughs> it is about the last laugh. He who laughs last, laughs the best. She who laughs last, laughs the best. So there they are, with no regard for you. They don't want to work with you, they don't want to collaborate with you, they're ignoring you, they're rejecting you, they want nothing to do with you because they see you as a nobody. But tomorrow you'll be on top, 
tomorrow you will be thriving you will be doing more than surviving you will be thriving tomorrow you will be making money tomorrow you will be good you will be skilled at what you're doing tomorrow you will be a mighty giant tomorrow you will be winning like never before they will be looking at you in awe they will be saying oh my goodness wow she's amazing he's amazing oh my goodness see how she's winning they will have no choice but to recognize your greatness they will not be able to deny your power anymore they will not be able to deny your talent anymore they will see mu how much of a great person you are and they will be begging you please work with me please be a part of my project please help me they rejected you then they will want to be part of your thing then the choice will be yours will you work with them or not me i would work with them if they bring something to the table but if not i'm not working with them <laughs> then somebody will say i'm just like them i'm not just like them i'm not just like them you're not just like them you may work with them or you may not work with them it is up to you to decide if it's gonna work against you no furthermore if somebody doesn't want to work with you today do not hate them for that do not judge them for that all it means is that you should grow all it means is that you should become more you can't be at level one and expect somebody on level 100 to work with you they will not collaborate with you grow keep growing until you reach that higher level when you can work or you can have a meeting with whoever you want to have because you have developed yourself if they don't want to be with you they don't want to work with you they don't want to collaborate with you use that not as a demotivator but let it motivate you let it inspire you inspire you to work even harder to improve to become better at what you do oh you did not want to work with me right i will show you that i will be better at my craft I will let you see, and it's not about them, but they will see that you will grow, you will become more, where they can no longer deny you. They're working with somebody else, not you. You're not jealous. You're happy for that somebody else. Jealousy will cripple you. You're happy for that person. They're doing better than you. You're not jealous. You're happy to see them doing better than you. They are doing better. You're allowing it to inspire you. There is no hate. There is no envy. There is no sadness. There is inspiration. There is feeling happy. Knowing that someday you will get there. Someday you will win too. And the same person who was denying you, the same person who rejected you will be begging you. They will want to work with you. They will be making a request. Call it begging. Call it requesting. Call it whatever you want. The point is you're not staying down there. The point is that your situation today is not your situation tomorrow. Do you know that it is true? Do you know that you're a winner? Do you know that you're an advancing man or an advancing woman? Do you know that all you do is win? Do you know that everything is working out for you? Do you know? Do you remember your power? If you know these positive things to be true they are true you will decide as a co-creator with the most high you will decide how far you go you will decide 
how much you win nobody else is gonna decide that for you you are co-creator with source you are a co-creator with infinite intelligence you are a co-creator with the most high with god with the universe and because you know that you can create too you will choose great things you will create great things you see the planet was created the universe was created but everything was not finished back then there are new things to be created it is not over every day it's been created creation happens all of the time the, the planet the world the universe is becoming more all of the time and you have a part to play in this it is not some outside force deciding whether you win or not you will get to decide you get to decide you're not like a puppet you get to decide and because you get to decide you will keep becoming more you will keep growing and then one day people will look at you in awe the same person who rejected you will be looking at you and saying wow wow she's thriving he's thriving he's rich he's healthy is wealthy is amazing is abundant she as well hold your head up high hold your head up high tomorrow is a brighter day the day after is an even brighter more brighter day how about that i'm here in the heart of nature it's been raining it's been raining in the distance the water is flowing so much water is flowing it's been raining the rain gave a bit of a break i came here to make this video for you i did not let the rain stop me the same way don't let anything stop you i see the rain as showers of blessings you see the sun is shining as well it's all beautiful mm. It's such a pleasure to be here in nature. I'm sending you all of this positive energy. I'm sending you all of this abundance energy as I'm here, just me and my mango tree. <laughs> hey, a bug wants to be part of it. One love, God bless, and all the best. And all the best. By the way, subscribe not subs well subscribe to the youtube channel but the point i'm making is follow me on the instagram account you can see it written below at manchester castle follow me on the instagram account one love god bless as the breeze is blowing and all the best